It's a problem that can ruin families financially. Surprise medical bills. That's when a patient gets a giant bill when they unknowingly end up getting services from an out-of-network doctor. Cairo 7's Matthew Smith takes us on a rare behind-the-scenes look with our state's senior senator. You did all the right things. You bought your insurance. You asked, will I be covered? Where should I go? And then you, the patient, ends up in the horrible position of having to negotiate, you not knowing. Senator Patty Murray hosting a small private session discussing a sensitive topic, medical bills and how they can take an entire family down. When your family is struggling, living paycheck to paycheck, a $100 normal ER bill is enough to make you think about, is this really an emergency? So when I received an almost $300 physician's bill on top of that, I was stunned. Lisa Broom lives in Lake Stevens, but she spends plenty of time inside hospitals. Her daughter has juvenile arthritis. How old was she when she was diagnosed? But as she explained to the center, it was a bill for her that caught her off guard, even after years of experience inside hospitals. A legislation from 2019 fell short. Now, Senator Murdy tells Cairo 7 she is confident something can emerge from Capitol Hill in the next couple of months. My goal? is to make sure that we protect patients, people who should not be holding the ball at the end of the day. Well, here in Washington State, there is legislation that stops some of these issues from happening, but there are loopholes, including people with federal insurance. That's why it's so important, not to mention other states, which is why the senator met with these women here. I worked for, in the health insurance for 15 years. Among them, Jamie Hansen. Her son is doing well now, but a heart infection two years ago, well, it had them on the brink of bankruptcy, a tough pill to swallow for a recently widowed woman raising a teenager. The bill sent to me was for $96,000, and that was a bit of a shock. And then as the options kind of started to dwindle, I started to get scared, and I started to think I was going to have to sell my house. And then, you know, where would we live? Would I be able to pay that off? As she explained to the senator in today's roundtable, she got help from the state's insurance commission. Still, it was costly, a story Senator Murray says she plans to bring back with her to D.C. Matthew Smith, Cairo 7 News.